Chapter 789 Wu Dong Qian Kun In the depths of unique devil region, darkness enveloped the sky and land. Occasionally, a dim ray of light would shine in. However, in the blink of an eye, it would be devoured by the darkness. From time to time, ruthless roars would be emitted from the distance, reverberating endlessly across the sky. Swoosh! Two light figures rapidly flew past at a low altitude. Their gazes were extremely vigilant as they continuously swept their surroundings. Vigorous Yuan power spread around their bodies. These two figures were Lin Dong and Ling Qingzu, who had left the Burning Sky Ancient Stash three days ago. Their target was naturally the Supreme Purity Celestial Pond in the depths of Unique Devil Region. Back then, Ling Qingzu was clearly a little startled by Lin Dong's decision to follow her. At the very beginning, she had clearly wanted to reject him. She had a prideful character and did not like to owe others a favor. This was especially the case when the person in question was Lin Dong. The prideful character in her heart made it a little difficult for her to accept. However, when she finally saw the brilliant smile on the young man's face, she slowly swallowed the rejection that was on the tip of her tongue due to some unknown reason. She had a cold and proud character. When she interacted with others, she was indifferent. However, it was very obvious that this indifference was somewhat different in front of Lin Dong. Perhaps it was subtle, but it did exist. The source of this subtle difference was clearly the indescribably complicated relationship between the two of them. We have already entered the depths of unique devil region. The demons here are extremely powerful. Additionally, although the demons are troublesome, we still need to be careful of others. Ling Qingzu gazed into the distance as the light figure flashed past. After which, she tilted her head and spoke to Lin Dong. Others? Lin Dong was startled. He was clearly a little stunned. There are also disciples from other sects here? They are not disciples from other sects. Ling Qingzu shook her head and said, There are also many treasure seekers in the depths of unique devil region. However, those who are able to reach this place are definitely not ordinary people. Even in the entire Eastern Zon region, they can be considered experts. These people are extremely powerful. It is not surprising that they have reached the profound life stage. In their eyes, there are only treasures. As long as there are sufficient benefits, they will not hesitate even if they attack the disciples of super sex. Profound life stage. Lin Dong's pupils shrunk slightly. It seemed that the people in the depths of unique devil region could not be compared to those he had met outside. Even in super sex like them, a profound life stage practitioner would possess quite a high status. In this unique devil region, although the stronger one is, the greater the repulsive force one will receive. However, if one is only at the profound life stage, the repulsive force will not be too intense. However, we have always minded our own business and minded our own business. They will not interfere in the great sect competition. However, this place is basically outside of the great sect competition. Therefore, we must be careful. Ling Qingzu softly said. Lin Dong slowly nodded his head. Those who could survive in this area were no pushovers. If they really wanted to fight, it would be a little troublesome. There is still half a day before we arrive at the location of the Supreme Purity Celestial Pond. That place is extremely well hidden, and it is likely that it will not be easily discovered. Additionally, the Supreme Purity Celestial Pond will only appear once every month. I have calculated the time. Today should be the perfect day. Therefore, we must hurry up in order to prevent others from beating us to it, even though that place is quite well hidden. Lin Dong nodded his head once again. He was just about to speak when his eyes suddenly hardened. His gaze suddenly looked towards the distant ground in front of him. There was an extremely wild and violent fluctuation being emitted from that spot. That is, Lin Dong's eyes narrowed slightly. After which, he saw that the wild and violent fluctuation was actually being emitted by an extremely large demon. At this moment, a light figure was suspended in the air in front of it. Numerous extremely sharp attacks poured down like a storm, directly suppressing the demon until it was unable to move. Such powerful strength. When Lin Dong saw this scene, astonishment flashed across his eyes. That demon also possessed the strength of a 9 Yuan Nirvana stage. However, that person was able to completely suppress it. From the looks of it, that person's strength was at least at the peak of the 9 Yuan Nirvana stage. That is also a treasure seeker from the depths of unique devil region. 
Let's go. Do not talk to him. This is a taboo in this place. Ling Qingzu glanced from afar and said. Lin Dong nodded his head. After which, the two of them did not reduce their speed as they directly circled around the battlefield in the distance. Bang. When they circled around, that demon also fell to the ground with a loud bang. A red-haired middle-aged man had killed it. After which, his eyes looked towards Lin Dong and Ling Qingzu. There was a rich vigilance in his eyes. Soon after, he dug out an item from under the demon's body, stuffed it into his clothes, and swiftly withdrew. So vigilant. Lin Dong smiled softly upon seeing this. However, his heart was somewhat grave. That person earlier was filled with a fiendish aura. Clearly, he was someone who frequently hung around the edge of a blade. Such a person was the most troublesome to deal with. If all the treasure seekers in the depths of Unique Devil region were like this, it would truly be a headache if a conflict occurred. The two of them exchanged glances, and saw the graveness in each other's eyes. Soon after, their bodies moved, and they increased their speed as they rushed towards the distance. Although they were only half a day away from their destination, there were quite a number of demons roaming about along the way. Hence, by the time Lin Dong and Ling Qingzu reached their destination, half a day had already passed. It's here. Ling Qingzu's slender jade-like finger pointed towards a mountain range that had appeared within the darkness. Her usually cold voice had also quietly sighed in relief at this moment. Lin Dong lifted his eyes and looked over. A mountain range was faintly discernible within the darkness in front of them. From a distance, it looked like a completely pitch-black ancient beast was lying on the ground. Faintly, one could hear the savage roars of demons being emitted from within. Let's go, Lin Dong smiled and said. Try to hide your aura. There are quite a number of demons here. If we are surrounded and attacked, we can only flee, Ling Qingzu reminded. Yes. Only after seeing Lin Dong nod his head did Ling Qingzu gently exhale. The green lotus under her feet disappeared, and the Yuan power glow around her was withdrawn. Soon after, the two of them stealthily rushed into the enormous mountain range. Swoosh! Due to the fear of alerting the demons within the mountain range, the Lin Dong duo's speed was much slower. Deafening roars were occasionally emitted from various parts of the mountain range, and were filled with brutality. Lin Dong was half a step behind Ling Qingzu. His mental energy had also been completely unleashed at this moment, and he could sense even the slightest activity within the darkness around him. Be careful. His sweeping mental energy suddenly rippled. Lin Dong's eyes hardened, and he suddenly grabbed Ling Qingzu's smooth wrist. His eyes looked towards a certain spot in front of him, where a pitch black winged black panther was lying dormant. From a distance, it looked just like a black rock. These demons borrowed the demonic chi that permeated the unique devil region, and were clearly able to perfectly conceal their bodies. Previously, even Ling Qingzu was unable to detect them. Yes. Ling Qingzu gently nodded her head. Soon after, a pair of somewhat bright clear eyes glanced at Lin Dong in the dusky environment. The latter smiled upon seeing this, and released his hand. Soon after, he muttered to himself, it feels pretty good. Although Lin Dong's voice was soft, it was still heard by Ling Qingzu. Immediately, a trace of embarrassment and anger flashed across her eyes. She gently inhaled a breath of air, and her chest rose and fell for a moment. After which, she ignored Lin Dong, and her body rushed forward. She circled around the winged demon leopard in front of her, and continued deeper into the mountain range. Lin Dong looked at the graceful and exquisite figure in the dusky darkness, and involuntarily laughed bitterly. It was still all right normally. However, why was it that every time he saw Ling Qingzu's clear and cold face, he could not help but want to say something to break it? This kind of thinking was really a little vile. While laughing bitterly, Lin Dong once again quickly caught up to Ling Qingzu in front of him. The two of them carefully shuttled through the mountain range. Moreover, the route they took was quite strange. This continued for around half an hour before the darkness in front of them suddenly became much brighter. A mountain valley appeared in front of Lin Dong and Ling Qingzu's eyes. Lin Dong could sense an extremely majestic energy fluctuation from within the mountain valley. Two figures rushed up the mountain wall of the mountain valley with ghost-like speed. After which, they looked inside, only to see a pond deep within the mountain valley. It flickered with a seven-colored luster, and the light scattered, illuminating the entire mountain valley 
making it look magnificent. That is the supreme purity celestial pond. Ling Qingzu looked at the seven colored pond water, as a moving smile of relief finally appeared on her face. Chapter 790 Wu Dong Qian Kun. Above the mountain valley, Lin Dong's gaze also shot into the valley. After which, it paused on the seven colored pond water, as some astonishment flashed across his eyes. Clearly, he did not expect that there would actually be such pure energy within the unique devil region, which had been corroded by the demonic aura. It's said that this supreme purity celestial pond is the place where an expert from ancient times died. His bones have seeped into the ground, isolating the demonic aura from the corrosion. At the same time, this supreme purity celestial pond was formed. Ling Qingzu's soft voice rang out from the side. There's a demon guarding this place. Moreover, it's very strong. Lin Dong's gaze turned towards the front of the supreme purity celestial pond. On the dark ground there, a gigantic black monster snake was entrenched. This snake had three heads, and its malevolent fangs flickered with a cold glint. Saliva dripped down, directly corroding the rocks on the ground. Lin Dong was able to sense an extremely tyrannical energy fluctuation from the body of this three-headed monster snake. According to his guess, the strength of this monster snake was not the slightest bit weaker than Lei Qian, who had half a foot in the profound life stage. This thing is rather troublesome to deal with. However, it's fortunate that these demons do not possess any intelligence, and only rely on their instincts to kill. It's fine as long as we lure it away, Lin Dong muttered. Yes. Ling Qingzu nodded her head. She also knew that it would be extremely troublesome to tangle with these fearless demons. If they did not thoroughly deal with them, they would definitely not give up. With a wave of Lin Dong's sleeve, the demonic corpse appeared in a flash. Just as he was about to control it to lure away the monster snake in the mountain valley, his eyebrows suddenly frowned, as he shot a glance at the darkness behind him from the corner of his eyes. What is it? Ling Qingzu could not help but ask when she sensed Lin Dong's expression. It's nothing. Lin Dong hesitated for a moment, before shaking his head. With a thought, the demonic corpse shot out explosively. While in the air, it sent a fist rumbling out. A swift and fierce force violently smashed against the body of the monstrous snake. Bang! A low and deep sound rang out. The monster snake, which was originally in a slumber, suddenly opened its scarlet snake eyes. Furious hisses rang out from the three snake heads, before a black light containing an intense corrosive aura immediately shot towards the demonic corpse. The demonic corpse's nimble body flashed in the air, completely avoiding the black light. Turning around, it fled towards the exit of the mountain valley. Roar. Facing the fleeing demonic corpse, the monstrous serpent furiously roared towards the sky. Since it did not have much intelligence, it was unable to think. Thus, it relied on the instinctive rage in its heart to swing its tail, transforming into a streak of black light as it chased after the demonic corpse. The rumbling sounds quickly spread out from the valley and eventually left the valley. It settled. Upon seeing this, Lin Dong smiled and patted his hands. Soon after, he nodded towards Ling Qingzu. Only then did the two of them rush out and land beside the Supreme Purity Celestial Pond in the valley. Ling Qingzu squatted down beside the pool. She extended her hand into the water and sensed the unique energy that permeated it, before joy flashed across her face. Can you help me guard the valley entrance for a while? Ling Qingzu lifted her head. An extremely feminine bashfulness flashed across her clear and indifferent eyes at this moment. Oh, all right, Lin Dong was taken aback. Soon after, he laughed dryly as he understood. Then, he turned around and left. Ling Qingzu looked at Lin Dong's back as he left. Only then did she sigh in relief. Her hand removed her veil. Just as she was about to remove her clothes and enter the pool, a hand suddenly reached out from behind her and stopped her. You. This sudden turn of events caused Ling Qingzu to be startled. She hurriedly turned around. After which, she saw Lin Dong, who had once again turned around and returned. Immediately, fury surged on her pretty face. We have been targeted. However, before Ling Qingzu could fly into a rage, Lin Dong's eyes looked towards the darkness outside of the valley as he slowly said. What? Upon hearing these words, Ling Qingzu's eyebrows immediately knitted together. A faint cold glint flowed within her clear eyes. The two of you have been stealthily following us for so long. 
It's about time for you to show yourselves, right? Lin Dong stared at the darkness in the distance and said in a deep voice. Earlier, he had faintly felt that something was amiss. However, that feeling was extremely faint and even he thought that it was an illusion. However, just as Ling Qingzu was about to remove her clothes and enter the pool, he once again sensed a faint aura fluctuation in the distant darkness. Since you are unwilling to show yourselves, I can only force you out. Lin Dong looked at the still quiet darkness. A cold glint flashed across his eyes. With a curl of his palm, green light condensed into sharp scales. Soon after, they transformed into green light that suddenly shot out explosively. Clang clang. As the scales shot into the darkness, a clear sound was immediately emitted. After which, sparks surged as the dark forest shook. In the next instant, two black figures shot out in front of Lin Dong's and Ling Qingzu's slightly cold gazes. Ha <laughs> ha, this brat has such sharp senses. The two of them landed above the valley entrance. They looked down at the two people in the valley and laughed in a strange manner. Lin Dong's eyes were somewhat gloomy as he looked at the two people who had appeared. Both of them were wearing black robes and their appearances were somewhat similar. From the looks of it, they seemed to be brothers. The two of them had a rather decent appearance. However, their somewhat long and narrow eyes continuously roamed over Ling Qingzu's lovely body. The smiles that surfaced on their faces also caused them to appear a little filthy. What a beautiful woman. The two of us brothers have seen countless women. However, the one in front of us is the best of the best. One of the black-robed men's eyes greedily paused on Ling Qingzu's face, which was suffused with a cold aura, as he smilingly said. Originally, we only sensed the energy fluctuations from this side. It is unexpected that we would reap such a harvest. The other person also laughed in a low and strange manner. Lin Dong's eyes were gloomy as he looked at the two people, who were rather hateful. The fluctuations that were emitted from their bodies allowed him to understand that the two of them were experts who were half a step into the profound life stage. Their strength was not the slightest bit weaker than Lei Qian. However, this did not cause the current him to feel the slightest bit of fear. Hence, his eyes were filled with coldness as he stared at the two of them. After which, a sinisterly cold voice was slowly emitted from his mouth, If you don't want to die, scram. On the mountain wall, the eyes of the two black-robed men slightly narrowed. Dark coldness surged within their eyes as they gloomily stared at Lin Dong. They parted their mouths and laughed. An eight yuan nirvana stage brat actually dares to say such words in front of the two of us. He really doesn't know his limits. Beauty, this brat's little ability is unable to protect you. Why don't you follow us brothers? At that time, you can also enjoy this supreme purity celestial pond. Ha <laughs> ha. Ling Qingzu's pretty face turned as cold as ice when she heard the frivolous teasing from the two of them. However, this appearance caused the hearts of the two of them to itch even more. You should recuperate first. The time that the Supreme Purity Celestial Pond will appear is limited. I'll deal with these two. Lin Dong tilted his head and looked at the ice-cold Ling Qingzu. A smile that was filled with killing intent surfaced on his face. This killing intent was exceptionally dense. Lin Dong did not know why it was so difficult to endure this killing intent in his heart. However, his rationality told him that he did not want to let any of the two fellows in front of him escape. These two should be the Yang brothers, who are rather infamous in unique devil region. The one on the left is the eldest, Yang Zan, while the one on the right is the second, Yang Wei. Both of them are experts who are half a step into the profound life stage. Moreover, it is rumored that they are extremely vicious and lecherous. They were once wanted by some super sects. However, since they are hiding in unique devil region, even the super sects are somewhat helpless against them. Why don't we go together? Ling Qingzu hesitated for a moment. The two people in front of her were not weaker than Lei Qian. If Lin Dong was alone, it might be somewhat strenuous for him to deal with them. We do not have the time to wait here for another month. Lin Dong smiled and said. If they missed this opportunity, the Supreme Purity Celestial Pond would only appear next month. Due to the great sect competition, it was clearly impossible for them to stay here. Be careful, I'll come out as soon as possible. Ling Qingzu was somewhat hesitant upon hearing this. Soon after, she gently clenched her teeth and nodded towards Lin Dong. Her body moved and she entered the Supreme Purity Celestial Pond.
Her graceful figure was akin to a graceful white carp as she swam towards the depths of the celestial pond. Soon after, her white dress floated up. The smile on Lin Dong's face slowly disappeared as he watched Ling Qingzu enter the supreme purity celestial pond. His pitch black eyes were sinisterly cold as he turned and locked onto the two people on the mountain wall. Ha ha, don't be anxious beauty. The two of us brothers will accompany you in a while. The young brother's eyes were boiling hot as they looked at the supreme purity celestial pond, which had started to undulate. Searing lust rose within their eyes. There's no need. The two of you should accompany each other in the underworld. Lin Dong's body slowly rose into the air. Soon after, a ferocious smile surfaced from the corners of his mouth. With a clench of his hand, a palm-sized scarlet red cauldron appeared in a flash. The two people in front of him had clearly completely aroused the killing intent within Lin Dong's heart. 